So in this video, I'm going to show you a glitch which you can use in your EAFC 24 career mode to get any of your players up to 99 potential. Now, if you didn't know, each player is given a set potential at the start of the game. However, this can change due to a few factors. For example, transfers, form and loans. Now, within the game itself, there's two ways of seeing a player's potential. And you need to know these so that you can see if the potential is improved when you do this glitch. Okay, so this first method to find a player's potential only works if the player is 21 years old or younger. But if their status says nothing or something generic, like at the club since, or contract expiring in a certain amount of months, then their potential is below 80. If it says showing great potential, then their potential is between 81 and 85. If it says an exciting prospect, then their potential is between 86 and 90. And if it says has potential to be special, then it's 91 or above. Now, this second method doesn't allow you to see the potential itself, but it does allow you to see the change in potential. So, for example, if a player's market value goes down, then you can see that their potential has gone down. If their market value goes up, then their potential has gone up. So, with the combination of these two methods, you can work out a player's change in potential. So what you do is you loan this a player whose potential you want to grow. So Rico Lewis, for example, exciting prospect. Let's add him to the loan list. And then you wait for some loan offers to come in and you accept them. Okay, so we've already received a loan offer. However, it is a loan to buy option. So we don't want that. What we can do instead is delegate and just ask for a normal loan. And that should be fine. Wait for them to agree to the loan offer. That might take a few days. Now, once your player's out on loan, make sure to save your game first before you do anything else. So once I've saved my game, I'm going to recall my player from loan. You have to pay a small fee, but that doesn't really matter in the long term. Okay, so sometimes when you recall a player, their potential goes up, sometimes it goes down. In this case, it actually went down. It says showing great potential, whereas it did say an exciting prospect. Now, if this is the case, or if the value goes down without the status changing, then what you need to do is just quit the game without saving. That's why you've saved it, and then go back in from the save point. And as you can see, he's still on loan, so it's obviously not saved me recalling him. So I'm going to recall him again and hope it's better this time. Still says an exciting prospect and his value stayed the same. So this time it stayed the same. You'll have to do this a few times, but eventually it will go well. I've recorded him again, and it says an exciting prospect, but his value's gone up 18%, which means his potential's gone up within the range of an exciting prospect. So for example, it could have gone up from like 86 to 88. Once your player's had a loan where their status or value has increased, what you need to do is send them out on another loan. So I'm gonna loan list them again, and wait for more offers, then do the same thing again, accept any loan offers, and recall them. Okay, so for some reason, after I recalled him, Aston Villa have asked to loan him again. I accepted it, and he's back on loan there. So what I'm going to do is save the game. And there we go. After I recalled him from his second loan, his status now says has potential to be special. That means his potential is now 91 plus, having started at somewhere between 86 and 89. And you can do this again and again, all the way up to 99. So that's how to do the glitch. If you've got any questions about it, leave them in the comments below. Subscribe if you found this helpful, and I'll see you guys in the next one.